All right, guys, welcome back to another episode of Dope Talk TV. It's yours truly low key. Got John here with me, got Jay over here, got the dogs in the back. You already know how to fuck with rocking, man. Episode 73. We appreciate everybody that's rocking, liking, sharing, subscribing, all that good shit. Don't forget to do just that. Go down in the link. You know what I'm saying? Get yourself some fucking merch if you haven't done so already. And yeah, man. We're fucking back with another one, man. Jeez. We got some brews. We got some motherfucking good company, man. We got yeah. some good weed. Yeah. Can't ask for much more. Yeah. I think I took too many dubs. Yeah, my dog is fucking litty like a titty. Get it together. I'm not going to lie. I'm going to try. But listen, man, right now, guys, I just had a technical malfunction right before yep. we fucking started. Yeah. And it, it brings me into my first fucking thing I wanted to talk about. Do y'all fucking... Can y'all trust robots? Like, if it came down to a fucking, like... I am Ledger, fucking I am Robot type I robot, of situation. I yeah, yeah, I Robot. Would you be able to fucking survive? I tell you what, we're in the verge of that right now, I believe. With all the fucking technology changing, it's only a matter of time before they're like, look, put this helper in your house. Like Alexa, now they got the drone that flies around your house and it can Get check your property. Out, yeah, yeah the, the Amazon drone. And it station that docks itself and it comes out and like can check your property bro, i don't trust none of that shit bro I i'm like will smith and i robot bro i'm like yo don't i don't want that in my house you know what i'm saying like for real because it's like if you could program it to do some shit somebody mm. else could hack it and program it to do some other shit like, like some like, sexual for real. shit like some fucking yeah yeah i like Suck it my talk, dick, robot. talk dirty Suck talk dirty dick. i don't i don't trust it i don't trust it but you know what that's where the world's going to yeah yeah, it is. It is. And I really feel like if they have some type of evidence, they would really need a warrant. Even though they have evidence on you, they would need a warrant, right? The fuck are you even talking about right now? <laughs> you know what I mean? Like surveillance. Like, you know what I mean? Uh, they feel like they could tap into that type of shit, right? No, nah, but the thing is, in the terms and conditions, a lot of people sign off their rights and you don't realize it. Yeah, that's why I was telling a lot of people recently when people were, you know, when that shit happened with like Instagram and they put out all this shit, all the information that they could, you know, get off you. Yo, I was like, bro, it's been like that, that though. though. Like, you just never read the fine print. Whenever then, you signed up for social media, you skip right through those 17 pages. Who's going to read through that, though? Have you Fact, I sat there and tried to look it. at how much shit is it's in there? It's a lot, bro. And then the way they word shit. No, it says you know literally saying? in the Instagram one, it says that you can't sue them. You're not allowed to. Once you sign that contract, you're not allowed to sue Instagram. It says that you got to go with them to like, um, what is it called? Like, keep it out of court. I forgot what the name of that is. But I looked at that. I was telling my wife. I'm like, yo, I'm like, you know, you're not allowed to sue Instagram. If you look at the terms and conditions, it says that if you have a problem with them, by law, you got to reach out to their support team to get help. But you can't take this problem to court. Is it true? I don't know, man, but that sounds like some scary fucking shit. Freedom is a facade, <laughs> you fucking pieces of shit. There's no I don't such thing as freedom. Mm -hmm. I'm scared. I'm scared, Ricky. You think you're free. It's the perception <laughs> of being free. Wow, this weed is very good. I don't usually do crack, but when I do crack, I do this kind of crack. He does it right. He does it right. But nah, man, it's some crazy shit that's been going on in the fucking world lately, bro. And it, it gets me thinking, bro. You know what I'm saying? Like, is world peace possible? Is it? Do y'all think it's really possible? Let me give you my educated uh, stance on that. Um, my educated opinion on them is uh, everybody in the world can go fuck themselves. Uh, I don't think it's possible, and I'm just waiting for this fucking bitch to blow up and all of us to die. So I like thank it. you. I like it. Talk dirty. That was fucking amazing. That was a round. Let me give one more round. Let me give one more. That was the fucking best thing I ever heard. That was the best advice, bro. Holy I ever heard in my motherfucking shit. life. All lives matter. Yeah. Oh, God damn, bro. Nah, 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 nah. Realest nah, thing I'm I ever just heard. Kidding. Hold on, we might get canceled. Stop. I don't want to get canceled, <laughs> guys. Like, yo, just like Eminem, they're I'm trying to cancel Eminem. I saw that. Man, they try to cancel everybody for everything. Bro, Fuck they've up. been trying to cancel Eminem since he came out. Good luck with that, you fucking pieces of Facts. shit. Eminem's been we shit swear. for the last twenty years. We swear in this podcast, and we like fucking talking dirty. Nah, bro. I love it. Back to the original question I just asked, man. I don't think world peace is possible, bro. I don't think it's possible. No. Because if it was, it would have happened at some point. There's never been one point in history where the world was at peace. Bro, money's There's always still been around. some type of war. You know what I'm saying? Like, money something's always power. going on. Bro, it's like, bro, we're going to have different opinions. Yeah. No matter what. But does, that have to, does that have to fucking cost thousands of lives, though? 
But it doesn't no. even matter. Peace means peace completely. Yeah. And guess what? If your neighbor's a piece of shit and you got beef with them, there's no peace there. Yeah, facts. So nah, at the end facts. of the day, humans are just fucked up, bro. We're always going to have a problem with that guy that cuts you off and almost fucks up your car. That you get out the car yeah. wash, you People fucking are, yeah. asshole. Nah, no, I completely agree, bro. You know? People are just pieces of yeah, shit. Yeah, like. Bro. Like we were just Selfish. talking about earlier, bro. There's some people that are just disloyal. Mm-hmm. You know what I'm saying? That's another thing. Like there's just some people that are disloyal and you can't, bro, you can't fix somebody that can't, you know what I'm saying? Can't be well fixed. Well broken. Well like, broken. Nah, facts. Facts. Except yeah. me, I'm not broken. There's a lot of things that are broken in life, man. Like my motherfucking heart. Damn. Bless you. Tell heart. me how your heart got broken. Let's I was, hear it. I was walking through. And I fucking fell in love with a whore. He fell in love with a whore. So what what else? Life. What happened next? Tell me. I fell in love. You said that already. Fuck. With a whore. But what happened? And then what after? happened after you fell in love with a whore? I almost tried to have a kid with her. <sighs> You know what? Let's cancel this guy. Let's fucking cancel this guy. Yeah, that's yeah. canceled. That cool. John, you, know you canceled. Let me tell Get you the what? Fuck Let's talk about families because this guy I has a you. fucking family. I got a family, but I would have never. This guy wiped could be my up. dad. I would have never wiped up my wife if she would have had kids. That's a personal <laughs> opinion, though. She yeah. took me with kids, but I would have never took her with kids. Nah, fa- a yo, listen, thing. man. Hey, shout out to y'all stepdads, Straight step parents, up. stepmothers, all of y'all my out there. That, that you know, what I'm saying, yeah. I know a lot of good people that were raised by step parents and shit, but. Personally, I wouldn't be. I just can't do it, bro. I can't. I'm I can't just a piece be with a girl that already has a kid. I'm shallow. And I would completely understand if the girl would do the same thing with me. If I already had a kid and she's like, "Nah, I can't fuck with you because of that," I'd be like, "Yo, I completely." When I met my wife the no, first night I met definitely. her, I told her that I laid it out like literally as soon as we started the conversation. I'm like, "Yo, before this goes any further, I just want you to know I have two kids." Right, and I was like, if you ain't cool with that, I'm like, then we gotta just stop this here. There's no sense in wasting our time. And she was like, I'm cool, man. The kids are cool. I'm like, cool. But if it would have been the other way around, and she would have told me that, I'd be like, ooh, yeah, uh, about that, yeah. <laughs> I'm gonna go to the bathroom. I'll be right back, and I would have left. Jumped out the fucking window. No, nah, there's a couple girls that I've left. <laughs> <laughs> but the thing is, you know what? This is not a laughing matter because how'd you, you leave them? Yo, shit. Yo. How'd you fucking no, leave I literally them? left. I like dropped them off and never came back. Like at a bus stop, at a like a fast food joint. Yeah, you fast them food. Off? I told her to give me a number one with a large sweet tea, and you never came back. This guy right here and is I a drove, fucking champ. That's how car. you do it. I'm give me a up. number one and get yourself some fucking nuggets. Get bitch. your fucking <laughs> shit together. You know what? As a matter of fact, there's a Texas a Texas school right now that's teaching women how to play their pot, how to walk behind men. I'm not a fucking feminist, but learn how to fucking play your pot. I'm just kidding. Nah, nah, Damn. Nah, nah, I love nah. you, babe. That's fucked up. Yeah, it's funny He's that married. you mentioned He's married, that. Married, yes. It's funny you mentioned that though, bro, because I remember the older couples will will walk like that. No, PR, I would see old thing. ass couples, nigga. The niggas in front. Mm. He's walking in front like ten steps. The girls like behind him and shit. I'm like, nigga. Let me tell on, you something. Bro. I believe that women are made to play a certain role in life. Like mm. obviously, if no, we have no, a family. No. Right? You're going to be doing the cooking, the cleaning, and taking care of the kids plus getting the money? Nah, nah, nah. Exactly. Nah, so no. shut the fuck okay, up, okay. man. Hey, hey, listen here. Listen here. <laughs> because ultimately, listen here. ultimately, Yo, ultimately it's the way it is. Women are like, oh, we don't. No, you got to learn how to cook. You're not going to be my wife if you can't cook. Nah, yeah, man. Nah, you nah, eat. That, nah, it's true. You it's true. I, need a, I need somebody that's going to cook. More for than sure. sandwiches and cereal. You know, I can't my really talk shit because I could cook, but I'm like, ah. If I try, I could cook. Bro, you know but at I mean? the same time, you are the breadwinner. Ultimately, yeah. that's what it is. We got that old school mentality, but that's what the fuck it is. Yeah. At the end of the day, let's say, for example, if your wife is home all day, then dinner should be cooked by her. Mm-hmm. But if you're home all day and your wife is working, hey, that's cool too. And yeah. it's vice versa. Exactly. Then you should have yeah, nah, cooked. it should. Exactly. But that's the thing, man. We got to play a team. Can, yeah, it's got to be a team thing. Because it, it is be. a team. It is. Facts. Yeah. If yep. it's not, then what are you doing? You're playing against each other. You know exactly. Like, and being and miserable, bro. Yo, even when you play basketball, right? If you were playing basketball with me, right? And you were guarded by two dudes, what do you expect me to do, right? You expect me to jump in and help you. Mm-hmm. So that's exactly how it works in any relationship. You got kids, you got a problem. You expect that other person, you're going through a hard day. And let's say you need to be in your room in bed all day and you got a kid. You mm. expect your spouse to be like, man, he's going yeah, through something. I'm gonna yeah, handle you gotta business. Pick it up. 
Yeah. Sometimes it's got to be 70 30. Sometimes it's got to be 50 50. And that's 50. what it is. Sometimes that's it's got to exactly be 60 it. 40. Yeah. You know it has what to I mean? be something. It, yeah. But you, bro, you just play off each other's strengths and weaknesses. Exactly. Like, you know what's going on. You know each other. You know what I'm saying? Most couples know each other. And that's when yeah. shit Enough grows. To, to know when you need to pick up a little bit extra slack. And loyalty I mean? comes a long way because when you're petty yeah, yeah. and you're just like, oh, well, I did this. Well, I did that. It's just like, what about when you're fucking stressed out this day? It doesn't matter what you did. It's just, you need me today. I'm going to be here today for you. Facts. You see what I'm saying? You you need to be in bed all day. You're just going through it. You don't want to come out the room all day. You need me to bring you your dinner in the room. You need me to bring you this in the room. Yo. Mm-hmm. You know what I mean? That's Everybody true. goes through shit, yeah. bro. And that's part of being a fucking team, that's man. True. You got to mm-hmm. take care of each other. Exactly. Part of being any team. You know what I'm saying? Because being a marriage other. is a team. You know what I'm saying? Like this podcast, this is a team. You know what I'm saying? You got to take care of each other, bro. If yes, you don't, then sir. what the fuck is the purpose? Yo, John. For the last <laughs> fucking time before you break a goddamn knuckle over there. I almost fucking broke my knuckle, bro. <laughs> Holy fuck. God damn. Look how simple that was. Hey, hey. but listen. Cheers, guys. Cheers. 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 Sponsor me, Corona. Sponsor, Corona. Sponsor, sponsor. You're not get, supposed to say that name. I covered it. But hey, but Like listen. and subscribe, guys. Like and fucking subscribe. Like and if and you subscribe. don't like it, hey, guys. So listen, I found out the other day it hurt my fucking heart. Only about 10 to 15% of y'all are actually fucking subscribed. So everybody else that's watching, if you're not subscribed, get the fuck out of here. Get fuck the fuck out of here. here. Yeah, we don't need no fucking fake love yeah, over here. Why fuck are you, you. Watching? You're watching our shit and you're not fucking thumbs up and you're not commenting. Hey, Yo, it makes bro, me think you're a fucking hater. I'm gonna tell and you if what. If you're not a fucking hater, then go down. No, fucking like the it's, video. It's subscribe okay. and it's hit okay. that notification <laughs> bell. Okay, it's okay. It's okay. Listen, <laughs> let me tell you something, guys. Tell me. Tell me. You guys are watching for some fucking reason. You know why? Because half of y'all motherfuckers try what we do. You guys can't fucking do it. You guys can't. And I'm not trying to be cocky, but I'm fucking cocky if you get what I'm fucking saying. Exactly. Okay, Ricky? He's not trying to be cocky, but he's cocky. Let I me like show that. you something. You guys are cocky sometimes, right? Us gentlemen know how to be fucking cocky. Yeah, you know fact. what I mean? When we go nah, to the gotta, bar. You got to pop your shit sometimes, bro. This shit ain't yeah. easy. And everybody can't fucking when do we, it. When we, really go, that simple. when we go to the fucking bar, the you bar. know what I'm saying? I know I see a couple women at the bar. They drinking and shit. I don't know how y'all be approaching these women. When you go to the bar, I don't know. It's different times, bro. Like I went to the club the other night and I was with some youngins. I was like, yo, I felt out of place, bro. Mm -hmm. You know, I'm like, man, I told him I was going to show up. Let me show up. You know what I mean? Give him my word. Bro, I felt so out of place. And I'm like, man, I try to approach a fucking girl. I don't even know, man. Like it's different. It's different in the club, bro. How do y'all approach women in the club or when you went to the club, Jay? The same way I approached my wife in the club. I just... Mm -hmm. Well, actually, it was my birthday. I was out with my dad and my uncle, and they. My dad went to the bar to buy a drink, and my wife was at the bar, and he's like, "Hey, it's my son's birthday. You know, it'd be cool if you meet him." Random ass shit. R.I.P. to my daddy. And uh, yeah, she for real. she came by, and when she came and sat at the table with us, I ignored her completely and kept talking to everybody else like she wasn't <laughs> sitting there at the table. And that's how I did. And then after that, I walked up to her. I was like, "Yo, come talk to me over here." And then if she wanted to come talk to me, she would have met me back at the bar. If not, she would have left. And she met me back at the bar, so she wanted to talk to me. See what I'm saying? If not, I would have left it where it was. I'm not thirsty. And then now we're married. 12 years later. Three kids. Happily married. Nobody does that. I got time under my belt. You fucking pussy ass young motherfuckers don't got time. I got 12 years invested in a relationship. You yeah, don't see that anymore. Different. Yeah, that's, that's different. That's bro. a flex. You know, that's nah, a flex that is a ass. flex. 12 years, bro. That's a long fucking time. As a matter kids. of fact, yeah. fuck out of here. Yeah. Round of fucking applause Thank over you. here for Thank my you. guy. Shout 12 years you, of babe. marriage. I love you. Congratulations. Babe. Bless <laughs> your fucking heart. <laughs> <laughs> I, nah, bro. I'll tell you the what. Way I would have cheated. I've approached women, bro. <laughs> I fucking go. You know what I'm saying? I've gone up with my phone. He's like, he pulls my dick know? out. He's yeah, like, I put it on the bar. Quick dick pic. You know, quick dick pic. That's Check it. it out. Just. Check it out. She's like, oh yeah. Let me. Yeah. <laughs> let me <laughs> buy you a drink. <laughs> T Pain shit. Yeah. You know right? Let me buy you a drink. Nah, bro. I asked this girl the other day, bro. Or the last time I went to the club, bro. And she's like, what, nigga? You don't think I can afford my own shit? You think I'm fucking broke? (laughs) (laughs) Nah, what happened was, I was chilling. I was like, hey, you trying to smoke? Like, what's up? Like, And she was just like, nah. Like, And I was just like, but the first night I met you, you know what I mean? You hit the blunt at the party. 
So you don't want to smoke. So I'm just like, man, like, mm. I don't know, man. Fishy like, vibes. Fishy I got, vibes. I got fishy. So I was like, yo, like, nah, you know what? Times are different, bro. Like, you should, bro, if someone asked me to smoke, I'd be like, yo, I'm down. Yeah. Every Fast. time. Like, every Fast. time. Like, come on. Like, I don't know, bro. So I guess you can't, I guess women don't like to smoke nowadays. Well, listen, bro, I'm not going to lie, bro. To play the devil's advocate, I've been fucking laced before. So you got to make sure you know who the fuck is rolling what. What You know what I'm saying? If you don't That's have true full too. trust I've for been somebody, laced before too. you can be laced. If I've you been laced it, with to me, PZP. To me, bro, yeah, yeah, bro, I, I got laced it. with, I, I think it was coke because no, like, I, got I was fucked. I was grinding my yeah. teeth. I thought I was having a heart attack. No, yeah, me too, bro. I thought nah, I was me. dying. But it was, it was... An experience to learn from because I'm like, bro, you can't trust everybody's shit. Remember when I did shrooms? You know I mean, Yo, that's true. even with drinks. <laughs> like if I didn't, if I didn't Roofies. see you pour that shit, I'm not fucking yeah. taking that drink. Yeah, facts. I don't know what the fuck you. Yo, put even in if that you're a dude now, you gotta be careful. You get roofie, get robbed. Yeah, you get fucked up, bro. These fucking Cardi B ass bitches. Shout out to Cardi though. With your hey, fine ass. you but, ugly ass bitch. Yeah, you fucking ass. Ass. shout out. Right? <laughs> he said shout out with your fine ass. <laughs> shout out. <laughs> But yeah, nah, for real, you gotta be careful, man. You gotta mm-hmm. be careful because mm-hmm. people are fucking pieces of shits nowadays, guys. Straight up, the fucking rob. Look, I tell you what, if somebody fucking robbed me, I would kill him. I'm just kidding, I wouldn't kill him. Please don't come after me, YouTube or in the algorithm. <laughs> Jeff Bezos, please don't come after me, I'm, fucking Bill Gates. I'm gonna tell you what. I'm gonna tell you Bill what. Gates, don't do I'm scared it. a little bit. I'm gonna tell you what, Ricky. I well, remember when me. we got so fucking high off mushrooms. Oof. Oof. I felt well, like I was. Let's, wait, wait, let's, let's like rephrase that. Let's rephrase that. Yo, how much time we you got? Remember because when I got high off mushrooms? You fucking asshole. It usually tells you. Oh, we got time. Oh, got we got time. time. We got motherfucking time. We got so high off Pull fucking mushrooms. Out. We need a high. We need a bigger memory card, <laughs> guys. We need a bigger memory guys, card. Yeah, Show we do. We do. Need to Yo, I'm a, I'm a fucking Go piece of shit. Go down and get yourself some motherfucking merch so that we can get a fucking memory card. Can you support me, man? Because y'all's gonna start OnlyFans. Yeah, I'm gonna start getting naked. Feet only. Y'all want to see my ball sack? Only feet. Only feet in a sack. No dick pics. You want to see my sack and my toes? I'll put them in fucking. <laughs> and honey and honey and you wanna sprinkles. see his sack and his toes you'll you send it to see, all of your hoes you how about that no, you, Ooh, guys boss, ever, you, you, you guys wanna Holy. see a sack and peanut butter I'll show you I'll just get on fucking show me it again I didn't see it last time I didn't see it last no, time no, no, it's kind of good. Send, it, send it to me again send it to me again Whoa. No. just click the link just click the link <laughs> no I'm just kidding no, he's I'm not a, kidding I'm not I'm not I'm fucking stoned though. Holy nah, shit! Yeah, I'm pretty fucking real. Nah, I'm not stoned I'm enough. Rip. I'm not nah, stoned enough. The Get out the crack pipe. I remember the day that we did fucking mushrooms though, guys. Nah, we was fucked. And I was fucked. No, no, that day, guys. We've done mushrooms plenty of times. Fuck I've never yeah. had a bad trip. Bro, it was my third but that time. That day, that day, them them shrooms were strong. They hit different. They hit different, fucked. bro. And we got fucked. Like, I remember feeling it the most when we went downstairs to take Remy out. I was fucked. I That's was when it started fucked. creeping up on me slowly. Bro, I was but fucked. Eventually, so, eventually bro, f- my boy Jay over here, man, he hit the climax. <laughs> I almost died. <laughs> Shout out to you, God. Nah, nah, for real. Nah, My nah, boy man. was going nah, through the, it, man. The thing was, is like he did it like four times in a row, and yeah, he was fine. He was fine in a row. He said, "I am. You know what? I am a body boy. He's not boy. a fucking druggie. He is, but I am. I but am. he likes drugs. Yeah. If you consider heroin a drug, I guess. I mean, <laughs> whatever. It comes from a plant, right? Yeah. Well, yeah, like yeah. shit. Yeah. So fuck it's natural. Guy. Heroin is natural. Let me tell you, son. Why am I tea so white, bro? It's crazy. I've never seen white teeth. I don't know why. Let me see your sec. Oh, <laughs> that you don't want to see. Is my that white elephantitis. <laughs> <laughs> Prove it. Prove it. You know what Damn. elephantitis is? Prove it. I show you it's an when one nut is the size of a goddamn fucking boulder. <laughs> <laughs> prove it. <laughs> it's just kidding. But he needs to prove it. Damn, I was high. I couldn't even finish it. Yo, my I'm dog right. fucking froze. <laughs> My dog straight fucking. Shout out to my sponsor, Corona. <laughs> Round of applause. I said, I said, bold. Round of applause to Corona. 
Let me put my headphones on. My, my dog man. almost blew my eardrum out. Yo, bro. get some fucking man made eardrums. Get some fucking, fucking perspective, bitch. you piece of shit. <laughs> Holy shit. Nah, but we were tripping so hard, man. Yeah, yeah, we were tripping so fucking hard. Bro. I was at home and they had to go get my wife. Yeah, we had to go get his wife. Then we had to fucking. John wanted to call 911. I'm like, don't call 911. Nah, bro. Honestly, I got scared, bro. The face of guilt and shame I saw him fucking John. I Ivy says the same I felt thing. bad, bro, because I was like, yo, I know he feels fucking bad. Yeah, yeah, I was like, I'm fuck good. Yeah, I felt bad. Nah, bro. I was, the, I was, I was sitting like, there, and when you started tripping, tripping, I was like, I looked at John calm as fuck. I was like, bro, go get Ivy. Remember when you looked at me, you're like, you good? And I'm like, no, yeah, I'm yeah, not. Yeah, no, I was like, bro, go get his wife. <laughs> that was the first thing that I fucking <laughs> I said. Was, we, so had, we had, like, neon lights in the room like bro, this. Nah. And, bro, it was like, when the light turned blue, this motherfucker went gone. <laughs> no, bro, bro, I felt like I saw he, a ghost. Bro, he was like, I saw a ghost. When I looked at my phone... Before I sat down next to Heck and he asked me if I was all right, I looked at my phone and the whole screen went. <laughs> I saw it and in I was this like, nigga's face. And I saw it you in know, his I face. I saw it in his body. His body went fucking numb. Nah, because we cold. were laughing. I told him, I was like, yo, bro. I was like, just smile. You know what I'm saying? I was like, everything's good. We're good. And he was like, nah, he agreed with me. He's like, yeah, yeah you're right. And no, then he started no. laughing. And then 10 seconds later, like, I, I just saw it in his face. I was like, bro, you all right? And he was like, nah. And yeah, then he sat bro. down and I was like, nah, he's fucked. <laughs> Mm. He's fucked. <laughs> I was fucked. <laughs> Literally and metaphorically. Holy shit. At one point, my wife was laying on me, and I'm like, babe, babe, where are you? Remember that? <laughs> yeah, yeah, that? She's like, I'm right yeah, here. I'm like, like, yo, I'm my, you. I'm my like, I'm gone. Yeah. But listen, round of applause for fucking drugs. All right. <laughs> You gotta love them. You can't to you, live drugs. with them. You can't live with them. You can't live without them. If drugs you know have been there my whole life. Thank I you was for there. that. Drugs Thank have you. been around more than my father, believe it or not. Listen, so. we're not condoning drugs, but if you got problems, do drugs. But we're not condoning them. But if you got problems, do drugs. <laughs> yeah, but you know what? <laughs> I'm not condoning I mean, anything. They, and we don't. We don't approve. Nah, the, we, we don't approve drugs. But if you got depression or you're yeah. suicidal, call the hotline. Yeah, just 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 nah, do what bro. you do. We've all you been know there. who's got depression? The John. fucking girl. Yeah, him too. Oh. The girl. That fucking, <laughs> the girl that got guy. arrested in Spain, bro, for being out at the beach. You know why? Because she's Hispanic. You know why? Because she was in Spain. She's Spanish mm. and she was out at the beach. Mm. Now, it was because she had fucking COVID. Everybody. What is COVID? A, what is COVID? She got a positive test. A positive, Are you allowed to say that? I don't Are know. Are we going to get flagged for saying COVID? We might. We fucking might. But yeah, she was positive, supposedly, allegedly, and she went out to the beach. She fucking got arrested with by some fucking <laughs> cops in hazmat suits, bro. And it just wow. got me thinking. I'm like, damn, bro. Is that the beginning of like some other shit? No. Nah. Like, if, is that what they're going to do when they're like, nah, you have to come take this vaccine? You know what the crazy part is? That crazy shit to think about. It's like Monsters, uncle. Inc. Bro, my uncle tested positive for COVID on Thanksgiving, and there was my mom was there and a few other people. Oh Nobody else got God. it. Nobody else got it. He was the only one who tested positive. Everybody was there chilling with him. Nobody else got it. Explain that. If it's so mm. contagious, right, and it's killing people so bad, how did he test positive and he had it? And he said he just got, like, sick. He's like, it wasn't nothing that he hasn't experienced before. So shout out to you, COVID. I don't know. I Rewind never, I, back to that episode. Round yeah. of applause to you, COVID. Remember that episode that we had? For fucking up the whole world. Let's Yo. rewind back to that episode of COVID we had, remember? When, when it was in my living room in the in the condo where I was staying? When, when this started? Uh, I heard living room. In the living room? <laughs> and we're like, Yo, shout out. I wonder who started this COVID thing. This is a hype. This ain't going to happen. And now Bro, look at where we are. A year later. That's Still crazy. locked down in some states. Yo, yeah, I've been everywhere. States. I've been on a fucking airplane during COVID. I've been in a fuck without a mask. This John, guy's a piece of I've been shit. I flew for pussy. Yo, I flew for It was for fucking ass. It yeah. was. And guess what? He got it. He got no ass. Oh, was it not that good? I got it. He got it? <laughs> Later on, not he that time. He can't say though. that. He can't say that because he knows you're watching. We're gonna just not front. He knows you're watching. No. He knows you're gonna look at this episode because you're creeping on him, and you're it's okay. Fucking creeping. I don't know hey, you, but, but I know one thing about you. Subscribe. Since you like it, you Yo. like it. No, no, no. Since you're already nah, here, nah, nah. if there's a dislike, I'm gonna assume it was you. It was. We all know it was. Yeah. Fuck you. Oh, holy I'm just shit. kidding, John. I'm sorry. Oh my god, I'm nervous. <laughs> that, he's a stepdad to that kid. Oh. And I'm sorry. <laughs> I might, I'm not gonna lie. I'm not gonna lie. I might have a kid out there. They, she just never told hey, me. That's hey. like I swear to God, that shit happened to my cousin. I swear to God. How Bro, would you react? Would you be mad? Would he's like, no, no. He's a 30 year old. He has kids already, and he's he's like a captain in the army. So Bro. he's like, yeah, he's done oh, well. He yeah, yeah, he but he just knocked. He just knocked. Niggas in the army be thotting. 
I got like 10 kids. Damn. You was in the army? Something like that. If you're in the military, you're a thot. <laughs> <laughs> yo, and I got female. Yo, yo, I got You know what? Do not disrespect that military. Shout out to you, military. Shout out to y'all. Y'all can be thoughts if y'all want to. Yeah, you can. You can do whatever the fuck you want. You can do whatever the fuck you want. Fuck you want. in the military. Shout out to you. Yo, I got mad people in the military. Shout out to y'all for nah, real. No, he's a piece of shit. Don't believe John. Okay. No. <laughs> <laughs> Cancel. Cancel. Yo, fuck this guy. A piece of shit. I love it. Yo, you're a fucking hater. Thank you. Damn, I appreciate that. My mom used to tell me that all the time. Nah, bro. My mom too. <laughs> I'll tell you something. Yo, my mom broke my fucking bong one time. Ooh. Yo, talking about moms doing shit. Shout out to you, mom. I love I you, mom. Love you. There was one day, man, I got so fucking mad. I come home from work. I fucking <laughs> try to go smoke a joint. And my mom, I can't find my weed. I can't find my weed. My half ounce is gone. No. And guys... This was back in the day when a half ounce was about 140 fucking dollars for some fucking all right shit. I believe it. It wasn't the pee. fucking best. Bro, fuck around. I fucking come home. I can't find my fucking weed. I go in my mom's room. I'm like, ma, what happened to my fucking weed? Like, I was so serious. She knew. She fucking knew. 140 fucking dollars. She's like, I threw it away. I told you not to have that shit in my house. Bro, I got so mad. I was like, mom. I need that money back because I spent $140 on that. And the face that she put when I said how much I spent on weed, bro, let me know that she mm. never fucking spent money on drugs. No, nah, no. Nah. <laughs> and, pri- and the price went up, too. Yeah, no. Nah, the price is not what it used to be. Like, I know people back in the day, they used to be like, man, I remember when a gram was like fucking 15 cent. <laughs> God damn. What type of fucking <laughs> Mexican brick weed were they fucking smoking? California gold. Fucking uh Oh, that had to be like back in the seventies though. Yeah, so yeah, 80s. yeah. Okay, that makes sense. Yeah, that makes back in the sense. day. Back it was it wasn't that great. You know what I mean? It was kind of just Reggie. Reggie bullshit. Hey man, I salute to those guys though. Go ahead, round of applause to the pioneers that fucking stuck it out on the side of a mountain and grew fucking mountains of weed. Shut because up. if it weren't for you and if it weren't for your fucking cultivation and for your pushing of the culture, we wouldn't be able to sit here and smoke all these fucking beautiful strains that we've have Man, available God today. What do you so mean? again, yo, yo, one more time, yo. And shout out to the people that fucking... Um, smoke weed. Shout out to the people that are fucking uh, pieces of shit. Nah, they're pieces of shits, and they fucking move liquor back in the day when it was fucking illegal. Because oh, now we're gonna oh, fucking oh. drink fucking go. Bro, we Coronas. talked about that the other day, guys. I f- I feel like where are we the at, people though? that the people that sell weed today, bro. The people that sell weed today, they're fucking around, and they're like the bootleggers from back in the day that used to make alcohol. And, and risk their fucking freedom so that people can have alcohol and enjoy themselves. I feel like it's the same thing except that alcohol won't fucking uh, heal your fucking, you know. It won't make cancer. you crash your car. Like, it's going to it's gonna fuck you up. But I feel like people that, you know, the dealers, you know, the street dealers, shout out to y'all, man. Yeah. 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 Shout, shout out to, out that, to y'all know, fucking be. street yeah. dealers that push the black market. Y'all yep. keep the fucking people yep. high. You keep them happy. And Keep ultimately, and on the streets. ultimately, you guys are gonna no. go down in the history books for being some fucking badasses, bro. Being badasses. some fucking, being some uh, fucking uh, modern day cowboys. Yo, shout you know out to I mean? y'all, man. Shout out to y'all, bro, because we love you. We and love without you. y'all, I wouldn't be able to get my flower, man. Nah, and facts. I, I need my motherfucking I need guy. My flower. Here, I need my flower. But yeah, guys, I'll tell you something. I think. It's hey, been yours oh, truly. Hey, it's been low key. We hey, appreciate everybody that's rocking, geez. liking, sharing, subscribing, all that good shit. Don't forget to go down, leave a comment, leave a thumbs yeah, up, fucking subscribe. If you don't subscribe and you're still watching, fuck you. Get the fuck you're out of here. Piece of yeah, shit. Yeah, piece of Shut shit. Fuck you. Hey, yeah. hey. I'm gonna go ahead. Hey. Yeah. Hey. Yeah. Hey. Yo. Hey. If you ain't watching my shit, <laughs> I'm gonna go split your shit. <laughs> I'ma go split the spliff. Ooh. I'ma go smoke this shit. Okay. I don't give a fuck what you're doing. Uh. I'ma go hit it with Bourne. Uh. Yeah. yeah, yeah, yeah. We coolin'. Yeah.